Hi guys, so I have a quick unboxing. I got two for you. I got one from Amazon and one from Joann's. And the Joann's one, I believe, was 30% off when I bought it, so yay. So this one I bought from Amazon, which is like the fourth one I bought. So I highly recommend the course. So these are fun. This one's a little different from the Thor and the um, Hulk and Iron Man. This one, instead of being a little character, it is just Captain America's shield. So I thought this one was cool because it was just a shield. So it's not a little kiddish looking. So if an adult wanted to hang that in their room, or a kid who still likes Captain America but doesn't want the cartoonish one, this is just his shield. So, I think that was cool. Simple colors, obviously clear, blue, and red. Or fun. Uh, basic toolkit, tiny bit of wax, boat, and the pen. Now this is like the third one I've gotten from Amazon. There's no tip in this pen. You see that? It was so bizarre. So obviously, um, I, this was my first kit. I, I have some problems, probably. I don't know if the wax would stay in there, but anyway. have so many spares, it doesn't matter. But I haven't had any issue with these guys. They're really fun. In fact, um, I just finished Pikachu for a child's birthday. That I'm giving it to that loves Pokemon, and I enjoy doing it because the yellows were fun, and it's one that I can get and not have to worry about feeling guilty by doing it. So, canvas is nice, a small. I don't even know what the size of these guys are. Nice and sticky, and then it comes with its own frame. So you can either hang it up or you can just put it on a desk or a dresser. And then this is just plastic. You just have to peel off both sides have a protective um, film on it so you don't scratch it. So you just have to cut it off. So. And usually these bubble rounds typically do like three different sizes. So they do like a medium. And like a large, and then the medium size, and then the small, regular size, and the same thing, a larger size, a medium size, and then the regular diamond size, and it just goes, so it makes a really cool effect when uh, it's finished. So just blue reds and some clear, and basic colors, I can show you, hold on. Thor. I think I did a review on Thor. I'm not sure. Here's Thor. So it's nice, cute little plastic. And you can see how the fun effect is. See the bigger ones and then the medium ones and the smaller ones. So it just has a really cool effect to it. So yeah, these turn out great. Highly recommend. Especially if somebody that wants to get into it but doesn't want a big one. Right here for 12 bucks. Um, I think they range from like 12 to 14, depending on the design. And you get everything you need. It's in a nice box if you're going to give it as a gift. You can put it in the frame. And then put it back on the box. And wrap it. So these are fun. And they're on Amazon. So this one is Joann's, and you can tell how you buy, when you buy it at the store because it's got this flipped up thing. This is a Diamond Dots. Diamond Dots um, just came out not too long ago. They added to their Disney. So they had Buzz and Woody. So and they're not too big. Kind of like my. Um, about the same size and diamond as my bugs 
bunny that I finished not too long ago. That I actually found. It's a, it was 13 by 13. I found a, um, what do you call it? It's called an album frame. And that's plastic too, so I don't have to worry about the glass breaking. And I found that for like, I don't know, it was nine bucks at the store. So I thought, oh, that's cool. Oh. Something lightweight and Right now, I'm just hanging out down here. Switched out my scenery from my um, other one I had up. So, yeah. So, with a Diamond Dots, they are very gracious with their kits. Um, you get a nice, you can see the quality if you've never seen a Diamond Dots before. This has a nice spout and is bigger, and then this one has no spout. So this is a upgraded kind of a tool kit. You have a squishy for your pen. This is the wax that's in a caddy. There's a couple of those little wax circles in there. The nicer of the um, pens. It's a pretty clear one, so you just stick that on the pen. And then there are baggies. So this is a very nice tool kit. This I call a bare bones. Has what you need. This is baggies to kit out or baggies for the extras and nice little comfy grip and a container to keep your wax from running out so I consider that a nice upgrade so this kit doesn't have a lot of colors so if you've never done anything before it comes with a big long explanation it's got pictures and it's in a couple of languages Especially if you're going to gift it to somebody. This one only has 11 colors. So let me um, hold what it got. And what do you use? Every, mine and my son and my... Um, what do you bullseye is everybody's favorite in our house. So. Well, my daughter likes that. Bow. If I could find bow, that'd be awesome. They made a bow peep. Oh, she loved that. So this has eleven. Um, you have schematic or the schematic, the um, chart on both sides. If you've never seen a diamond dots, they do have their own coating. You can look on their website and see a conversion if you're gonna keep them all together with your other extras, or if you're like me and you have all your diamond dots. Completely separate in different containers. So, let me know if those are very sticky. Let me get you in closer. Hold on. So, let me know if this nice sticky canvas has the background is not drilled, his face, and then there's two little words. So, he's not a lot of space to do. Well, well, it's a good amount. So the full camera size is 15.2 by 15.2. The design size is a 12 by 12. So you could definitely find a frame for this. It would be easy. This would be a fun one. I just went back and got Buzz. And you could do like a Disney themed like playroom. This would be fun to hang on the wall because it's not overwhelming. It's cute. And you could definitely change out when the kids are bored. So, 11 colors. Their normal colors start with 8. Their ABs start with a 5. And this is a quick little partial, so it's fun to do in between the ones. So, gray, black, Yellow, red, and they have um, ABs in both of those if you wanted to put some extra ABs. A brown, a blue, there's AB in that color too. Another brown, a mustard, another brown, and then there's the white AB, and then a 
brown. And if you've never seen an AB before, an AB just has a coloring, um, a coating on it. So it gives like a rainbow mermaid kind of iridescent. And it catches a light. And it just blooms up your kit and makes it pretty. Most Diamond Dots kits have ABs in them because they have their own ABs. Plus they have the metals. They've got neons. They've got glow in the dark. We've got a good variety for drills. The drills are all very shiny. They're very easy to work with. They're a nice, pretty, um, the cameras are great. Right. If you didn't know much about diamond dots, and on the fence whether or not to check them out, they do have um, what's called a 13 faceted round drill. So it has extra facets, which is the cuts like a, um, like a regular diamond that catch the light and make it shinier. So this is a paperweight came from a kit I bought from their at-home kits and it just shows you how it picks up the light. They just sparkle so well. I can actually get you. So this is my system I bought from Michaels and this is like see yeah this one. That could definitely be replaced with that yellow. Um, like I said, we got the silvers, the golds. And like a pretty purple, that's an AB. And this really fun neon, so if you want to add a bright color to something. So let me show you. I'm going to show you. With an open bottle. She wants me to get these open. This one open? Oh, yeah. Okay. And these bottles you can buy right in Joann's or Michael's or Hobby Lobby. I have them now too, so. Let's see how nice and shiny and well, it reflects the light. That's what's really great about their drills. Um, I would compare them if you've had Diamond Art Club. That they are right in the top notch for really good drills. So that's Woody. As I said, he came out not, not too long ago. He's a, a very cute... Be a nice quick kit to do. It'll be a nice kit to do for somebody to put in their kids' room or put in the like the playroom or um, just to brighten up. And especially because it's small enough that you don't have to commit to like a huge diamond art club size. And once they throw out of a certain you know, one they like, then you can pack it away and throw up a different one. That's all I got. Anybody has any questions? Anybody wants to know of anything I've done, enjoyed, all um, my products that I've done, if I haven't done a review on them, let me know and I'll let you know if I finished it. Any of the unboxings, if there's something you saw I unbox and want to know, hey, did you finish that? Did you like that? If there's anything you can't find, um, I do have a lot of things listed in playlists for his openings and new um, companies to me and stuff like that. Um, so definitely uh, let me know, drop me a comment, add that um, subscribe, and hit that subscribe button so you can see when I do a review on something that I got. So, yeah. That's all I got. You guys have a great
great night. And uh, yeah, remember that diamond painting is a craft. It is for fun. It's for relaxation. It's to share your love of all things shiny and pretty and beautiful with your friends and your family or just because it makes you smile. Bye, guys.